love with Ella Cobella. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Manoa. If you've never seen me before, and I really hope you've seen me before. <laughs> my name is Manoa. If you've never seen me before, welcome back to my channel for all my returning subscribers. This is Ronald Noella. Okay, first of all, I think it would be crazy if I was just to jump in and be like, oh hi, today we're doing this and that and that. That would just be crazy, right? But anyways, I have to address the fact that I've been MIA for a little bit. So for about um, a little over a month now, a month or two months, I was a little MIA. And I'm going to be honest with you guys. You know, sometimes it takes a lot to um, provide content with consistency just because you don't necessarily get the feedback that you want and it's hard to not get discouraged and all of that so I was dealing with that a little bit and I guess I was lacking motivation but I'm back like I never left and I'm ready to bring you guys some more amazing content okay yes today by the way I didn't say I apologize I very much apologize for my absence because I know some of you care about me not being on here and sharing some content so thank you for those that have been asking me to come back I'm so grateful for you guys thank you for continuing to watch me and you know what let's jump into this like we've been here first of all if you're new here go ahead and subscribe to my channel like what are you waiting for join the family come on subscribe okay <laughs> subscribe but like seriously subscribe yeah uh, you don't want to miss my content I upload two times weekly at least so go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss anything and make sure you click on that notification bell you can also feel free to follow me on all my social media platforms right here that's why I post daily snapchat Instagram and everything else go ahead and follow me okay I'll appreciate that <laughs> okay without any further ado let's get into this video <laughs> so today we're doing something a little special when I say a little special it's more scary than anything else <laughs> my girl Mama Maya challenged me I guess she came up with a collab we're doing a video where we have to do a makeup without any utensils and when I mean any utensils I mean like accessories you know no brushes no beauty blenders nothing like not even a sponge <laughs> not absolutely nothing and quite frankly I am terrified you know I don't know how this is gonna turn out and I'm super scared because if you know me you don't really see me using my hands much when I do my makeup I think hands should be out of my face unless I'm applying lashes maybe that's the only thing I want my, my hands that's the only thing I want my hands to be close to you know I just don't want my hands around my face when I do my makeup I feel like it just has no place <laughs> you know it's like this is really scary to me it's terrifying it's challenging and everything else I really don't know how this is gonna turn out to be but if you stay tuned you might just find out you know you know what I mean? So yeah, I'm anxious to see what how she did hers. I'm gonna go for a very simple look. I don't wanna kill myself and be like, oh, let me do this cut crease with my finger. I'm a sorcerer, I'm a witch, I can do it, uh-uh. We're gonna go simple. I'm thinking about a smoky eye to match my little gothic look. Uh-huh. Yes, yeah, so I'm thinking about something like that. <laughs> what I'm the most scared of is just how will I be doing eyeshadow? How will I be putting foundation without any brushes, without any beauty bun or this is no spritzing, you know? But we're already here, there's no going back. So without any further ado, let's get started into this video. video. <laughs> First and foremost, so I'm grabbing my Makeup Revolution Pro Base right here. It's called a blur primer. It's this beautiful black and gold right here. Just gonna apply it all over. It's so smooth. Like right now, my face feels like a baby's butt. Okay, if you know me, you know I like to start my look with my eyes. So that's exactly what we're gonna do. I'm not sure if we can use a spoolie or not, but girl. Girl, I cannot do my I cannot do my brows without using a spoolie as in brushing it. Make sure it's going into the right direction because not using a spoolie means that you're gonna be doing your brows and it's gonna be all over the place. And you know what? We ain't trying to do that. We ain't. We ain't trying to do that. <laughs> okay. Quickly brush my brows because we wanted to go into the same direction. really that quick <laughs> up next I uh, thank God we can grab a pencil because the pencil is not a brush it's you know it comes with that yeah so I'm gonna be doing my brows and see the thing is that we have to be really precise here because we don't have a brush to clean it afterwards so it has to be it has to be whatever it is I can't just play it has to be super precise okay 
you know usually I like to do my brows with um, a pomade but you can do no brows with pomade when you're just using your hands and bar. oh my god I feel like this brow is already thicker than this one is a little thicker than this one this is up close and personal huh? <laughs> that, that looks good <laughs> I really wish I could just have a brush to like make sure it's all lined so that's gonna be about it for our brows our brows are done guys so you know what the next step is I just even though we can't use a brush to like you know line our brows and correct them or whatever I'm just gonna use a shadow primer right here so I'm gonna grab my and I'm gonna use that as my eye primer just because I know it's a thick base and it's gonna give me what I'm looking for so I'm gonna bring it up and soon. Unfortunately, be mixing it with my finger. Bringing it up so I can get the highlight under my brow. You know, usually the excess, <laughs> the excess concealer would go on the beauty blender or the brush, but since here I have no way of doing that, I just have to manage. <laughs> so without any further ado, <laughs> further ado, I'm gonna grab this palette by Juvia's. Never mind. I'm just thinking and I just realized that a smoky eye is going to be too complicated because you need that extra black in there to pack it in. So I'm just going to do this like a, like a, we'll see. <laughs> okay, now I'm going to put this dark brown in my crease. Just a little bit though. I know some people do their makeup like generally without any um, brushes and they like to use their hands and stuff like that but sheesh I just can't do that <laughs> okay now I'm gonna take this color it's called Casablanca I'm just wiping my fingers because this is gonna be a lot of wiping fingers because I'm using my hands all over the place I feel like it's way easier to apply press eyeshadow compared to those matte shadows but the same thing on this side oh I just fucked up I took it way up so I just grabbed this Will be fine okay eyeliner the eyeliner I have it comes like in the cap with this thing so it doesn't count as using a utensil or an accessory because it already comes with it can we agree yay okay so I'm using my NYX eyeliner at least this is not anything new <laughs> so let's thank God for that Okay guys, we're done with our eyeliner, so <laughs> you guys know my favorite mascara is the Twilight Camera Action Mascara. This shit carries your, each of your eyelashes to the moon. Do you hear me? <laughs> now for foundation, I feel so sad today because um, I just realized that I don't really have a foundation stick that I can use. I do have a foundation stick, but that's from contouring that I'm using later but I'm really 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 anxious about just applying a bunch of liquid on my face and using my hands it's just it just sounds so nasty you know I just don't want to do it okay calm down calm down 
it's all gonna be okay. I I desperately need a foundation stick. Okay, so I'm gonna use my Fenty Beauty foundation. is never about like sliding anything it's about tapping you have to tap it so it really gets into your skin how y'all do it like how y'all do this shit <laughs> like do your makeup so far i'm proud of myself i'm holding it together i don't look like a clown yet so there we go that's the best i can do um it's good to keep in mind here that since we're doing everything with our hands, everything that is within like what's a stick or um, a cream will be easier to blend than liquid. It would just be like a little rough to do. So that said, I'll be using my Tarte uh, concealer. thing I can do <sighs> totally forget that I have to sit without any sponge or whatever so that is another challenge I just want to cry at this point you already know I won't be putting any powder like I ain't got time for this shit <laughs> I'm efficient to put the powder up in here and just use my palm like this I'm gonna take this right here and I'm gonna come over here like this yeah, because it takes it all like this. That's why you don't want to touch it. Because then it looks weird. Like this. <laughs> Take it off and I'll see how I can do that without paper. Oh my god, this setting is so uneven. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I'm grabbing my Tarte mascara again. I'm going under my eyes to hide this mess. <laughs> super scared of this but like we're about to contour I am grabbing my black opal contour stick we're gonna make like some really thin lines because then this shit is gonna be hard you know gonna blend it with hands as you already know so. oh yeah this is way too much <laughs> I'm gonna decrease and mostly considering the fact that I don't have a beauty blender it is a lot I look like a squirrel Yeah, guys, I just, <laughs> I really just want some powder on my face right now, to be honest with you. But you know what? <laughs> a girl has to be real. I'm using my Beauty Bakery Coffee and Cocoa Palette right there. And I'm going to be using the highlight as well, this blush and the highlight. So I'm going to in the blush first. Just a little bitty. A little bitty. 
Just a little bit of here. So up next, we're gonna do a highlight. And y'all know I like to, con to put some highlight on my nose. You do stuff like this that you realize the importance of brushes yeah that's easy to do with your finger actually yeah guys I think the only thing we have left to do is um, a lipstick like from far away it's okay you wouldn't know but like getting into details as a makeup artist like this is it's definitely something but lipstick today guys what should we do I mean the move for something a little dark there you go we don't really need any utensils for <laughs> I say utensils like it's the kitchen there you go we don't use anything to um, you know do our lips Should we do um, some lashes or no? <laughs> I love this lipstick. It's like so blunt. <laughs> it's a different type of color. Let's do lashes, guys. I believe that's it guys all I have to do now is spray my face and we will be done okay guys uh, we are finally done <laughs> with this challenge right here so I was able to complete this look without using any brushes any beauty blender um, <laughs> nothing I was able to this just you know with with me <laughs> and I'm pretty happy with the result and uh, the most important thing for me was not looking like a clown which I think we did <laughs> we did not do like we, we don't look like a clown so I'm pretty happy about that um, thank you Manila Mama Maya for this challenge if you guys don't know her please check her out I'll be putting her info down below she's new to YouTube and please welcome her show some love um, and yeah this was a fun challenge to do I almost cried I almost busted my ass down rolled down put my thumb in my belly but nah just kidding it wasn't that bad <laughs> but it was a little challenging when it came to the foundation and the concealer you know and sheesh we did it <laughs> okay so guys tell me what you think about this look like how did I do on a scale of 1 to 10 how do you think I did without using any brushes and all of that uh, and also please share your feedback on anything you want me to do specifically I'm glad to be back with you guys thank you so much for watching this video and hey I'm back, so it's on. You know it. <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next video. Don't forget, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share this video if you enjoyed it. And leave me a comment down below, you guys. I want to know who's watching me. Please leave me a comment down below. Say hi, even if it's like hi or whatever, you know. <laughs> yeah, let's just <laughs> and let's connect it. Add me on social media platforms, okay? Okay, guys, you guys are the best. Thank you so much for watching.